this video, we're working with measurement. This is capacity. And I want to show you some two-step problems. When you're going from always a larger unit to a smaller unit in a problem such as this, we're going to multiply, okay? But it's not so simple when we move from pints to ounces. If you will look, pints are, there are pints right here, pints to cups, and then cups to fluid ounces, okay? So we want to change the pints first to cups, and then we'll change the cups to fluid ounces. So th watch these two steps. We'll still multiply. So how many pints are in a cup? Two. So six times two is 12. So now we've just converted the pints and now it has become 12 cups. All right? Now we can take our 12 cups and we can change it to our final answer that we're wanting to achieve is which is ounces, the fluid ounces. So how many fluid ounces are in a cup? There, there, there are eight. So we'll do eight times 12. Now, there are 96 fluid ounces in 12 cups. So, six pints equals 96 fluid ounces. Right. So, suppose we have seven gallons and we want to convert that to pints. Larger to smaller, we know we're going to multiply. So, gallons, you first of all have to convert those to quarts and then we'll change the quarts to pints. Those, this is going to be two steps. So we're going to take seven gallons and we're going to convert it times four and get the conversion of 28 quarts. Okay? Then we're going to take our 28 quarts and we're going to change that to pints. How many pints are in a quart? Two. So 28 times two is 56. So there are seven gallons and in the seven gallons you have 56 pints. All right, so in this final example, we're going from four quarts to fluid ounces, okay? So we have quarts here, quarts to pints, pints to cups, and cups to fluid ounces. So you can tell that this is not gonna be a one-step problem. We're gonna to have to convert twice. So let's change the four quarts, and let's change those to pints first. So times two. So times two equals eight pints, all right? Now that we have the pints, let's look and let's go eight pints and we're changing the pints to cups. How many cups are in a pint? Two. All right, so times two, which is 16 cups. Are we finished yet? Do we have, no, we're not, are we? Because we're trying to get to ounces. So 16 cups, and we're changing the cups to fluid ounces. Now, this is gonna be times eight. All right, so 16 times eight, which is 128. Now we can say ounces, right? So 128 ounces in four quarts. So in this problem, we had three steps to convert. Just use your conversion chart and do one step at a time and you'll get to your final end result of what you're des you desire and you'll get it.